Hello. <laughs> I am Susan McCann, and I have been surviving stage four breast cancer for six and a half years. for this year's new and improved, really for like that. And I'm not going to talk about my cancer journey tonight, but instead, I'm going to tell you about my experience at past relay events. I cannot believe how nervous I am. <laughs> <laughs> 2007, I joined Team Sangamon County. My teammates were aware of my illness and were supportive and understood why I couldn't help much that year. My husband Mark and I went a little early to the relay so that we could look at all the campsites and could not believe all the open areas that were on the track. And when I saw <coughs> over 50 bags with my own name on them, it was truly a humbling experience. <clears throat> and it's affected me the same way at every relay since. I also saw bags with my mom's name my sister-in-law, friends, and thousands of other names. And I then realized how many people had not only made donations on my behalf, but also of loved ones who were currently fighting cancer, and also for those who had lost their battle. I changed. <laughs> it was becoming clearer what fundraising for the relay was all about. In the years since, while still being an active cancer patient. <coughs> I have tried to become a better team member, began to actively raise funds, and participate at the relay events. I met my goal for the last two years of individually earning $1,000 or more each year. <laughs> and my team has also been recognized for its fundraising efforts. Okay. <laughs> with a common goal, to raise funds to allow research for medicines for treatment and hopeful, hopefully, a cure for cancer, and to assist in specific programs and resources for cancer patients. I've made new friends at each event, enjoyed the many different teams' fundraising groups, and have a whole new respect, admiration, and friendship with my own team captain, Lou Robish, and all my teammates. Thank you very much for everything you've always done for me. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Thus far, my illness has prevented me from remaining at the event throughout the 6 p.m. to 6 a.m. schedule. It is my hope that I can stay the entire time this year, and I hope you will join me in that goal. I fight this illness every day. I'm asking you to come out to the relay June 22nd and fight with me for one night. I ask you to join the survivors, caregivers, volunteers, team members, the AC, ACS staff, and everyone else who dreams of the day when there will be a cure for all cancers. That's a big dream, but I believe it can happen. I have big hopes that will happen. Relaying big can make it happen. 